You know MJF wants to finish up the year as world champion as we head to our final pay-per-view, December 30th, World's End. But look at that on Long Island. to go through though including tonight to be what a counter in midair counter quick thinking by omega may be quick enough to winning the title kenny omega plants him with a a cover one two oh, oh. The pile uh, to it. To pull out the, the uh pile driver don't forget we are breaking for only 90 seconds in picture in picture Wow, this one, this one is taking our breath here, guys. This is uh, it's exhausting. Yes, it is a battle. Uh, it's like, exhausting for us. You can even imagine yeah. how it is for the champion and the challenger. We're getting everything that was advertised. Two of the very best in the entire world going at it. Ring and awareness for the champion, keeping his title around his waist, or actually around the waist of Jay White, to be perfectly honest. Be that as it may, Omega, who took to social media earlier today, and he said he had the chance to accomplish something very meaningful tonight. Protect my record and become a two-time AEW champion. Been a great match, great main event, back and forth. Both men fighting like hell to gain an offensive advantage and maintain it. That has not been successful on either side yet. Broken particles of the table everywhere here. And Omega walking over to a prone MJF. Uh oh. Dogged Omega. determination on the face of the challenger. He is in great shape mentally and physically. Come on. Deep in the deep in the deep water here, as we say. This has been an astonishing main event. Still in progress for the AEW World Title. And the champion just had his spine wrapped around the security railing surrounding the ring here. What a match. This is an amazing main event, ladies and gentlemen. Kenny Omega challenging that man, MJF, for the championship. The champion, the championship. Are we seeing the last ever title defense of MJF? Look what the challenger has done. Yep. He's taken off the protective guard from the rail. If he can power bomb the champion again, surely this match is over. Yeah, that's a, as you can see, a hard, sharp top, JR, yeah. to the top there. It sure is. And Omega, the great veteran. So skilled, so motivated, oh. so amazing. Well, he didn't want to get counted out. And he got a warning that time from, from Paul Turner. The official pleaded with Omega not to do it. Will he rule that decision, though, as this match continues? Okay, he's got MJF, as you can see, not straight ahead, kind of over to the left. The champion in trouble, down on the canvas. And here comes MJF to his feet, or at least attempting to. MJF is up. Oh, oh. Right the ropes, and Kenny hits hard on the top turnbuckles. Omega straddling that top turnbuckle. Didn't do himself any favors there. That was quick thinking by the champion. I, I think the challenger there has so many different moves in his move set that he was sliding between one and the other, and it was that hesitation right. that gave the champion the opportunity to get back on top. That is a great point. Uh-oh. Oh, now MJF really getting fired up. And MJF is just dangling on the middle turnbuckle. Oh, drives the knee in the back of the head. You can hear that one. Oh, another snap drive, and here we go again. Hey, the the other end here. One, two, no. Boy, that was closer than 19 is to 20. Oh. Again, Kenny with the force of that knee, but he didn't hook the leg. But again, you can understand both men are spent here, guys. But they push on. I think it was the excitement of the challenger who truly believed he had the title back in his grasp. Looking for it. 
Kenny feels good about this right now. V, trigger! History could be made. Omega looking for three in a title. Yes, another V trigger. This one to the shoulder. And now the one-legged angel, you can see it coming. MJF countered last time. He's not gonna be able to go. Wait a minute. What's that snake in the grass doing out here? Kenny had him with the one-legged angel. And Don Callis came out. Callis interrupting the match, interrupting Kenny Omega. Trying to heap more misery on Omega. Oh, one, two, no! One, two, not yet! Oh, oh my oh, God! Oh, that could do God. it! What a shot! Blue one, champion! Two, no! Ah. And Don Callis is up on the apron. The challenger continues on a biting. Callis has no business out here whatsoever. Well, I tell you, no. MJF got out of that V trigger, that big one. He's been thrown out, thank God. He shouldn't have been allowed in the arena. And now he's going to try the one-winged angel again. Forward roll. One, two, no. One, two, no. Back and forth, two, two, no. Nobody can get the advantage. What a match. An amazing pro wrestling match. Our main event here tonight. Knee lift got him. Heat seeker coming up. Boom. Man, if that doesn't do it. One, two, no! Oh, it did not God. do it! My God! What's it going to take to win this world title classic? More than we've seen yet, and we've seen it all, it seems like. Everybody on their feet! You are right everywhere. They are standing here at the Mohican Sun. You hear that chant a lot, but never more apropos than it is right now. It's a good night to join us, ladies and gentlemen, here on TNT. For you, Adam. Looking for his version of the Florida Sunrise, Adam Cole's move. That's in the Panama Sunrise. Couldn't get it. Let's go, Cole. One, two, and three. Oh, no, get it. What? Oh, many fans thought it was over. I did, too. With you. Oh! He kicked him right in the face now. Trying the Panama Sunrise once again. There it is. What? He got him. He got him. MJF got him. But he's not done. He's got to make sure. Does MJF. Another heat seeker. Boom. That'll oh. do it. Three One, seconds. Two. Historic, a historic AEW victory AEW for the AEW Champion. Champion. An amazing match, That's an amazing display of pro wrestling from MJF and, and Kenny Omega. Courage, stamina, guts, and a will to win. Both men have it. MJF had it right at the end. It's going to be awfully hard to find a better TV main event than we've just brought you here. What an amazing, oh, there's Samoa Joe watching on. What an amazing match we have all witnessed tonight here on Collision. The Ring of Honor TV champion literally and figuratively in the wings for the AEW world champion, MJF, but Wardlow. Oh, brother, this monster, God almighty. Once again, Wardlow. everybody gunning for MJF. Now, MJF has got to be in an eight-man event coming up, an eight-man tag event coming up on Wednesday to try to get his belt back against the Bullet Club. But who will MJF's partners be? Oh, there's Don Callis's main man. A dangerous human being right there. That's yeah, not kidding. How terrifying will the Book of Hobbs be with Don Callis as Ghost Rider? Oh, there's Bullet Club, gold, waiting for Wednesday. And of course, Jay White now knows it'll be MJF at full gear at the Kia Forum in Los Angeles on Saturday night, November 18th on pay-per-view. That'll be a classic. I'm telling you guys, you're not gonna find a better world title bout 
than what we have seen in this. I'll say it again. It's what all elite wrestling is all about. You're saying to the best of the entire world, respecting each other. MJF took his title, he took his legacy, but he earned his respect. Now, MJF will be the longest reigning AEW world champion in that young man's career. As we said, the eight-man tag event will be coming up. Orange Cassidy, Claudio Castagnoli for the international championship. That is all coming up. And then again, next week on Collision, we've got the 69 celebration. For Nigel and JR, I'm Tony Schiavone. Good night.